right, so we're going to look at how to learn scales melodically, put it into music straight away, rather than learning something like that in a position. When we move up and down this way on the guitar, it's potentially less melodic, less fluid, less musical. This way, up and down, is better. Um, context always matters. Anyway, so the idea, and you can apply this for the rest of your life. Um, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to take A minor. I'm only going to use three strings. So the strings I'm going to use will be the A string. Um, then I'm going to use the fourth and the second. So fourth and the third. Uh, so the idea, you can do it two main ways. One way would be to download the, the scale. So A minor or C major, same scale I'm using. Uh, and you can download the, the, the neck diagram of those of all the notes from A minor. The idea, other idea, you just play the three notes. I'm going to play an arpeggio playing three, two, one, round and around. So I'm not really thinking about this hand. That's on autopilot. So if I'm going to be playing um, arpeggios like this, what I want to do is I want to search the notes around here with my ears that I can that I can use, that can sound cool. If I get lost in the harmony and I'm confused, I'll play A minor, get that back in my ears, and then I'll start again. So the idea, I'm gonna start with this finger and I'm literally just gonna take it off. Sounds cool. I'm gonna try and see what it sounds like on the first fret. So it's tension. Okay, so now I know that note is tension. If I want it, it's there. It's all right, the next fret up. So I'm literally, my fingers may be changing, but I'm just literally moving up one fret at a time. So now I'm on the same note. explore the notes and see how they work. There we go, same concept. Different string. Lots of tension. So what you're doing is you're exploring the sound of potentially A minor ideas. Now through exploring, I'm hoping your ears aren't terrible, they don't have to be brilliant, but you know ears help. If I now put it into a musical context, I think, all right, well, I liked... That sounds cool. I'm not going to go up any higher. Don't need to. And I like this. The zeros, open strings sound cool. Second fret, third fret, fifth fret. Second fret, fourth fret, fifth fret. So let's get musical. And now let's have a play. Didn't like that one. Maybe. I like that one. Tension. Nice. 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 idea so you can use it for whatever style you want I was just kind of in a flamenco y bullerius mode um, but yeah you can start exploring scales like this rather than if I'd learned that scale like that like normal uh, I wouldn't have been able to play that cool stuff it doesn't work the same way so you can keep exploring further up the neck you can change to different strings. The idea is just to make it musical and trying to write stuff sooner rather than later. 
I spent a lot of time learning scales, didn't know how to use them. This way, at least, I'm playing A minor something, maybe. If it sounds good, we don't care. <laughs> there you go. So, um, if you want more of this stuff, you can hit me up for lessons, Skype lessons, if you're not in Lyon, France, and uh, like, subscribe, all that stuff, and yeah, hit me up for private lessons soon. See ya.